Hey guys, it's Grand Scores God, and I'm back again with another gas mask video. Today I have for you the Italian Vigile del Fuoco gas mask, which is the Fire Brigade gas mask. Uh, I haven't seen many of these around, so I presume it is scarce. Let's take a look at the mask. As can be seen here, without the filter, the mask resembles a human face. I mean, I'm not sure if it's only me, but this thing looks pretty creepy. This is the filter intake. Then we have the eye lenses. which appear to be a little, for some reason, frosted. I'm not sure exactly how this happens, but it adds character. Now, over here, we have VVF 36. VVF stands for Vigile del Fuoco, which is the National Fire Brigade of Italy. 36 is the date of manufacture. However, on the filter we have 40, which means that the filter was made after the, the mask. An, in an interesting thing on the underside of the filter is this. This says, al momento dell'uso, strappare questo disco. As you can see over here, there is, well, there was a strap, which would remove this, and the filter would be able to work. And it's pretty cool that the filter is new, I mean, it doesn't show any signs of aging. And also, I think that this underneath is quite interesting. Now, for the back of the mask. The straps on this mask are the classical five-pointed system, except that over here there is something rather interesting. On both sides, the bottom two straps can be removed, like so. As you can see, compared to the head, the mask is pretty small, and in fact it can fold on itself. The straps go inside. And it can fold like this. An interesting thing is that many Italian face pieces look like this, and they rather look like human faces. Now I'm putting this on. The mask was donned like a normal mask. And the the straps were latched on to either side. This is how the mask looks with the filter.
moving on we have the carrying bag something interesting I found here was these anti-dimming inserts which were not listed um, on the listing on eBay basically over here the instructions state that you have to take care of these, you don't bend them and use them only when you need to use them the bag is pretty basic but it's quite cool I think uh, the strap, the carrying strap is fraying but I think it adds character it doesn't look this is how to close the bag overall I think this is a really cool mask uh, it's the first Italian mask to my collection which as can be seen my display has been revamped I also have the horse mask here and my SCHR2 here the masks are held into place by these dowels and I had a longer dowel made so I can use this as a display stand for when I make videos all in all I think my collection looks much better now this mask is my 25th mask uh, I intend on bringing more in the future right now I'm bidding on a CEM the corrected English model and I hope to win it so I can add it to my collection hopefully I'll win and I'll be posting a video soon